A man in Eastman has a big heart and his desire to help out other folks, especially in this pandemic, has led to some pretty cool accolades. Suzanne Lawler takes you to Dodge County to explain. This is Roy's Deli. Sits on Main Street in downtown Eastman. It's a sandwich soup dessert kind of place. And a national gift retailer just gave Roy Grenade, the owner, the Lift the Spirit Award. Now it's great because he gets a little national recognition and a pat on the back for the good works he's done over the past year. We have been told that we have the best uh, chicken salad and pimento cheese. These are my mom's recipes that I started with. Roy Grenade churns out food in a tiny kitchen, but he's getting a big reputation. Oh, his food is so delicious. He Shirley Flagg appreciates the lunch menu, but Roy's is also a gift shop. One of the lines he carries, Dem Deco, just gave him the Lift Your Spirit Award. For a small business in a small town, that is um, unbelievable. Some might say what Roy has done this year is unbelievable. When COVID hit, he rallied folks on his Facebook page to come in and buy a boxed lunch for a health care worker. It just spiraled into a community-wide effort, and we were able to feed not only the hospital, but we fed the sheriff's department, the police department. He took on that challenge three times and wound up delivering 600 boxed lunches to frontline workers. But he didn't stop there. Even a small town like Eastman has homeless people. Roy says early in the pandemic, he would see those homeless folks sitting at his picnic benches out front when he got to work. And the guy with a big heart couldn't turn anyone away if they needed a meal. You know, they would ask us, you know, could we have a bowl of soup or could we have a sandwich? So it actually became a little um, lunch bag, so to speak. And it doesn't matter where he's at, you know, if he, if he can meet the need, he will. Roy's mom, Victoria, passed away a couple of years ago. He says she didn't just give him those cooking tips. She instilled in him the value of giving, which has clearly become a recipe of kindness. Suzanne Lawler, 13 WMAZ News. The Mac Ode also gave Roy $2,500 to give to the charity of his choice. He picked the Dodge County Baptist Association, which also does a lot of good for people in Eastman. Roy's Deli will also be featured at the Dimco shop at the Atlanta Mart for a year, which is pretty cool.